We're hoping that a phase two would be that we would be able to have someone stationed in here so that it can be literally a full all day um, operation. But right now we're going to limit it to some defined hours because we'll have to manage it from our reception area upstairs. But it is available particularly to the campus and to all of our stakeholders. And in a sense, the, while this is the defined area, we are saying that the center is the Cape Town School of Business. Of course. Yeah. Of course. So that if entrepreneurs need to have, and we've had a number of requests for bigger programs, bigger workshops, and so on, there are the training rooms upstairs, which we will make available to them, as we have done with the jobs project. So which is why we see ourselves being the hub. Right. The Cape Town campus by way of entrepreneurship. It is a hot spot and a bevy of uh, activity. So we're also looking to retrofit outside here as well to encourage more entrepreneurs that if, if you don't have space here, we're going to have a table along the platform of the balcony there so that people can tap into the hotspot and can still generate ideas if you need to still use the printing facilities as well. That, that would be For me, it was, I think, was a landmark for the history of small and large enterprises in Burnley. It was the first time that this event was held in the English speaking country in the Caribbean. Uh, we had the opportunity to discuss very thoroughly important issues related to micro and small enterprises, like microfinance, like micro uh, insurance, um, participation of the youth and women in developing micro and small enterprises, the availability of resources policy that are enabling. development of micro and small enterprise. So I think this is, is just, we are closing this very good year with the launch of this Entrepreneurship Resource Center here at KPO, KPO School of Business. As uh, Sir Hillary uh, and Mr. Topping mentioned, the Entrepreneurship Resource Center will provide a basis from which entrepreneurs, students, researchers, professors, all the university community interested in developing the micro and small business sector careers <coughs> can access relevant resources, toolkits, receive consulting advice, and benefit from training support as well as other target support. Equally, the center provides an opportunity for the KPM School of Business through their direct contact with the SME sector to strengthen their capacity to undertaking research and knowledge creation and will propel the Barbados economy towards greater innovation.